Stars and Stripes military families. It's a committee that started in Mansfield, Ohio. Because we didn't, we felt that it, the country did not pay enough attention to the veterans of our great state, great country. What's behind me is a half-scale replica of the Tomb of the Unknown Soldier, the real ones at Arlington National Cemetery. It's just to bring the plight of the veterans to the forefront of people's thoughts, at least for a while. It was uh, commissioned by Frank Russo, a city government person in Mansfield, Ohio. Frank Russo had um, talked to the carpentry class at Madison High School in Mansfield, Ohio, and um, they, they actually went out, measured it, did the half scale, did all the calculations, and then proceeded to build it. And then after he died, uh, the 40 and 8 in Mansfield took it over. Um, I was looking for something to pull in a parade. I wasn't sure what. Uh, we knew we had some, we knew someone had a trailer. When we talked to them at the trailer, they said, well, what about the Tomb of the Unknown Soldier? And I thought that's perfect. It's an icon because of what's buried there in Arlington. World War I, World War II, no longer a Vietnam contingent. He had, was identified, they have Take, exhumed him and they have just left a plane plot there but it's it's a symbol of we haven't forgotten and what we haven't forgotten what our armed forces has given mm -hmm. to this country.